On the people side, I think what's unique about CamCraft as well is we're very intentional about thinking about the whole person. Um, what are their physical needs? What are their emotional needs? What are their intellectual needs? Um, what are their spiritual needs? And there aren't a lot of companies that even think in those terms, but we try really, really hard not to just think about things in those terms, but to make provisions in those terms. How are we providing for our people in those areas? Do we have gaps where we can help people more in one of those particular areas? And so um, we'll, we'll talk about what do our people need? What are their biggest struggles? What are some of the themes that run through people in general and uh, people at this company in particular? And outside of the day-to-day -day work, um, it tends to be uh, marriage, parenting, and finances. And so we find ourselves talking about the, how can we help our people in those ways so that they're thriving, so they're, they're, they're not just uh, coming to work and going home, but they're becoming better people. In order to do what we do culturally, size is pretty critical. I don't think we could get a whole lot bigger at least in, in any particular location and still maintain that culture because that culture depends on human interaction. It's not driven by processes and policies, um, but it really is driven by communication and personal contact. So I think as we grow, uh, that would inform the way we grow, the size of company we are, maybe the size of our sites. Um, we talk frequently of acquisitions and, and we acquired an automation company and I just I can't see us becoming um, you know like a 2,000 person company on a big campus because I think it would be really really hard to know the people and stay engaged in their lives.